Hey guys, Thundershot TV here, Thundershot, whatever you want to call me. Uh, here for an update video. Obviously, I made a stream schedule. Um, I did not follow that at all um, due to circumstances of terrible internet, um, a lot of bandwidth usage in our area because during COVID 19, everyone's at home. You know how it be, you know how it do. But I'm here with some important updates about the future of my channel, the future of YouTube, Wrath and Flash, all that nitty gritty stuff that people definitely care about. Um, so first off, you notice I, you know, it's here. Uh, I think it'd be right here. It's a banner change, all that. Um, I rebrand on my YouTube channel. Okay, used to be the Infinite Nerd, Infinite Nerd for years. Okay, that was my name. But I slowly transitioned to Thundershot. Thundershot is my name now. That's my username. That's just what it is. Um, I don't know the history of it. Basically, I was, one night I was like space cowboys. I like thunder. I like been lightning and all that. Um, thunder, shot. Sound like a name of a space cowboy. Wada bing, wada boon. That's how I have the name rising. The name thunder shot. And so I am doing more YouTube content now. It requires less internet bandwidth usage. I can do content I enjoy more. Uh, so. Ignore my streaming schedule. If you want to follow NJ Yoshi, he's been streaming pretty much daily, anywhere between three to five hour streams. Uh, streaming Xenoblade Chronicles X in anticipation of Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. Definitely go check out his stream. You know, amazing streamer. I'm very proud of the amount of work he's put in and the amount of subs he's gaining and all the followers he's gaining and viewership he's gaining. Definitely put in a lot of work into the stream, and I highly recommend him. Now, what's about my channel? My channel, I'm going to be going back to content I used to do. Um, videos like My Theories and Thoughts on Doctor Strange. Where basically I just talk about things. I just talk. That's what I enjoy doing. It's kind of kind of undo. I like doing. I'll do a Let's Play here or there, or maybe be just a random gaming video if I feel like it. But that'll be my primary focus on my channel. Is like gaming commentaries, or like uh, maybe a vlog once in a while, or random content like that. The content that I want to make. Not trying to force myself to play a game for 8 hours straight on stream, because that's just not what I am. And now with this announcement that I'll be focusing more on YouTube, I'm also announcing that I'll be trying to go more towards YouTube gaming for live streaming. Now, well, this is not a permanent thing, and depending on numbers and how I'm, my viewership, I'm prone to change this, but I want to test it out. I want to, when I'm starting out, tread the waters of what's possible with my content and see what's best for me. Uh, I've looked into a lot of different content sites such as Facebook Gaming, DLive, Mixer, Twitch, YouTube Gaming, and YouTube Gaming obviously is the one I've decided to look a little more into. I've used Twitch for a long time and I love Twitch and everyone's there. It's I've never really had an issue with an amazing community. Uh, but it's just to think where I'm at with content. I think YouTube Gaming is just where the future of my channel is. Uh, obviously I will be going back to Twitch. I might go back to Twitch if YouTube Gaming doesn't adequately show the numbers I want to see. But that's all, all this is from the change. Now, obviously I don't have series yet now. It's like at the last time I did one of these. But the content should be for itself. And I think one big thing that's changing is Rising Flash. Now initially I want to be the YouTube content. I want to be the editor and all that. I promise stream highlights and with school and all that currently going on and the uh, hours it would take to edit my own videos on top of Noah's or NJ Yoshi's stream highlights would be devastating to me like mentally and I'm trying to take everything one step at a time and so I can't really make those stream highlights now obviously if you're an editor and found with an unpaid gig hit me up but I understand how much edit editing it takes to go into that, how much time and effort it does. So I would never, ever reach out to an editor saying, oh, by the way, we won't pay you for this position. No, but obviously if someone's so inclined and nice to you, we will definitely take you. Uh, another thing coming up is our, we're venturing into esports. Right now, we're looking into getting into two games, possibly three. Uh, third one I'll talk about later if we decide to. We're still having talks about it, but our first one is Valorant. Um, Valorant, is a, if you don't know, is a game made by Riot Games. It's an FPS game, which is CSGO-ish, 
shooter, and so we think it's how new with how new it is. We think it's the perfect opportunity for us to venture into esports, like how this clan used to be, clan org, whatever you want to call it. But get back to its roots. And I have experience with esports for the past like five, six years. So that would be primarily bad for me. So if you see a lot of content for me, just know I'm trying to make big moves with that. And well, I understand it's disappointing that you're not getting as much content from me as you want. Just know that I'm putting a lot of effort in the content I do put out, and I will never put out a half polished product. I try my hardest in every single project that I do, and I would never put out bad content for you, which is why I've been streaming less, because my stream started feeling like bad content, I was just getting tilted, low viewership and all this, and it was clear that I was getting low viewership because my content wasn't that good. But, so, well I can't say oh, I'll upload once a week. I'll be shooting to upload as much as I can, right? You might have a week with daily uploads and you might not another week. Uh, I understand it's frustrating to have a sporadic schedule from a content creator you like. Just know that every bit of content I do put out will be the best of my ability. And I, I might record something for you guys, and this might not be up to my standards. And I will literally delete the file. Because I refuse to put out subpar content for you guys. And... Let me get back to Fasting Flash. But sorry started this video, video seems a bit convoluted. It's trying to make sure I hit all my check marks I've listed down. Um... Rising Flash, okay. So the second game we're looking into getting into Rising Flash is Apex Legends. Now Apex Legends, it's, there's ALGS going on and any team can basically sign up right now. And so we're looking to get a uh, 3 stock for that. So if you're very interested in Apex Legends, leave it in the comment section below. Uh, we are requiring at least a plat ranking amongst one of two previous ranked splits. Uh, now we have tryouts if we get good numbers. Uh, there will be, with where we're at, there might be a small fee for joining the team. But obviously, one if we start making money from it, we will obviously change that to allow for that. And any money we make will go directly to players until that fee is paid off. So like if we have a $50 fee and we make like 500, I'll take whatever cut I have, or if I want to, or am able to, after I make sure every player gets their money. So like, we get $50 on top of whatever tournament winnings you have. That's what it is. Okay. This is where we're at right now. We're too broke, basic, almost college students who don't have the money or time to pay certain fees for certain esports but obviously there are talks about that if you are interested in joining uh, and we talk more about that in the future and thank you I want to say this again thank you guys for the amount of support you guys have given to me uh, I know I haven't been the best with uploading but it's clear you guys recognize the fact the amount of effort I put into my content when I do upload like that announcement video within 24 hours had a hundred plus views that was insane to me. I put a week's of effort into it, and you guys clearly enjoyed it. And so I'm trying to make more content that you guys clearly enjoy. And while I could be better at uploading, I just want to be known. I appreciate everybody that has helped me, and I can't even talk about how much I appreciate Noah Silva. Noah and Jay Yoshi Silva, whatever you want to say. He joined without he had content without any payment. He just enjoys making content and wanted help building his stream, getting advice from me, and making dual content under our name, Rising Flash. And I appreciate that a lot. And I want to be known that he's a good person and definitely check our stream out listed below. Go to our subreddit listed below. And let me know what kind of content you guys want, okay? I want make content you guys want. Now obviously I'm going to make everything, but I'll be trying my best to make content that you guys clearly enjoy and clearly want. Even if, no, if it's like, oh, do, all that, do this game, let's play, I might not do it. Like, there's some games I'm looking at now. Like, I'm looking at make possibly doing Final Fantasy VII Remake. 
Let's Play. That was like a fun game to me. I enjoyed Final Fantasy XV. No similar-ish in gameplay style. This was Cloud instead of Noctis. What's the good game? You know, I'm thinking of a certain Minecraft Let's Play, Minecraft SMP. Who knows? But what is matter and really important to me is the fact that you guys enjoy my content and you guys have continued supporting me over the years. And so thank you. So the future. Brown, Thunder Shot, signing out.